So a lot of times in terms of features, our features are driven of course by client demands and then you know, how, sometimes how big the budgets are. But it's not about where we've been in the past. I think the journey and the excitement about Palladium and onboarding people is about where we're going in the future. We're taking Palladium to the next level of ERP, of course, um, multi-bin locations um, and a workshop module, just one of the two things. We're moving aggressively to the cloud and business automation and alerts and notifications is all coming into the application itself. Getting the right technology was very important for us. A lot of people will buy accounting software packages based on a name and not on the underlying technology, and we're hoping to change that. Palladium optimizes the Microsoft SQL Server database. We've been compliant and certified on Windows 8 and Windows 10, and unlike Windows 8, Windows 10 is a lot more rigorous in terms of running applications throughout your source code and making sure the code, source code is developed with specific rules. And it also becomes a nice acid test to make sure that the developers are doing their job rather than tell you that they're coding to specific standards. Here we have Big Brother Microsoft coming along and saying, Yes, that is developed to the, the correct standards. And of course, on top of that, we're using the uh, Visual Studio platform. So because Palladium doesn't hold a static connection to the database, things like UPSs and cables, and even having a local server, no longer applies to Palladium users. All oh, they re requires either a wireless connection or a connection to the internet, and then off they go. And obviously with the optimizations within the SQL Server database, uh, if we lose a connection, it's not an issue. There's full rollback capabilities within Microsoft SQL Server. So the average Palladium client will walk around their office and not be tied with any legacy cables. From a, a reporting point of view, now we're in a world where reporting is really unlimited to the users of decent technology and a Microsoft SQL database. Previously, people would get their reports through a static report at a point in time. Now we have dynamic information through business intelligence, through Excel, etc. Microsoft has said themselves that Excel is the window to, to a SQL Server database, and we have lots and lots and lots of dynamic, dynamic reports that people use without having to purchase a Palladium license. But where the sex and sizzle comes in is Microsoft's launched this new Power BI, and we have a pack that sits on top of Palladium, and we are now exposing that information real time to users of the Power BI, and it really is at a fraction of the cost, taking business intelligence to the man in the street or on their mobile in a real time basis.